Hey guys, what is up? Um, I left my house and yeah, I decided to go get some Korean fried cheese because it sounded good and I was already out so I got two. Um, last time I was here, I discovered that I actually really like the potato one but I did just get went ahead and get the regular mozzarella as well but they kind of burned it a little bit, but that's fine. Beggars can't be chasers. Mmm. Mm. The main difference between this and the regular is the potatoes on the outside. But I really like them because it tastes like french fries too. It's a french fries and mozzarella sticks. Mm. I've definitely been craving these. <laughs> and it's definitely. Mm. I definitely feel good, dude. <laughs> So, um, I don't know how much I'm talking about today. What's new? Let's see. Uh, I do a vlog channel where I do my get ready with me, so I do my hair and makeup on that channel every day. Mm. That's my routine. Mm. So, Mm. Sorry, I can't get enough of this. Mm. I've recently... Mm. I've recently got on the Dear Evan Hansen bandwagon. I've actually never seen Dear Evan Hansen. I did a whole vlog about it. I'm <laughs> doing my makeup this morning, so I don't need to like, go into it more, but... I will say I love Ben Platt so much. I love his voice. He's so cute. Mm. He's just such a cutie. I've been watching a lot of musicals lately on YouTube, more so than normal. Um, Evan Hansen specifically just has a lot of inspiring, uplifting music. I don't know where it's falling, but I can't catch it because. I use a public restroom. <sighs> I was so dumb. I didn't go before I left my house and I was drinking so much water this morning. Like on purpose too. And I didn't go to the bathroom right left and then I had to pee right away. I was so scared to use it. I didn't want to. But I had to. I always took my like cast off and my splint thing and put it underneath my arm. I would never have even made it see any lime. So, but I did have soap in there and sanitizer. I try to sanitize my cup bone. Well, calf singing when I get home. Mm. That one's really filling.
the clouds, you guys, right now are so big and fluffy. <laughs> I haven't been out of my house in a while. Come on. So, I'm like really enjoying being out. Of course, something would be in my eye when I can't touch my face. I'm not going to touch it. Don't worry. Can't touch my face challenge. Mmm. Mmm. That. <laughs> oh my god. It's really good. Just the crispy and the friedness of it all. <laughs> it's like ASMR. I have an ASMR channel, but. Supposedly. LA's like in lockdown. Or like stay at home till August. And it's getting scary. Like, is this gonna be our I mean I guess when they find a vaccination that's like the cure. But damn, like this is our new normal, like just literally staying at home. Being scared of everything you touch. Everybody you see wearing the mask on our face. Like, that's, it's scary. Like, I see little kids with their mask on. I'm like, God, this is crazy. It's our world. Like, Will it ever go back to seeing concerts again? Will it ever go back to... I mean, nothing really goes back to normal after crisis. Like, look at September 11th. I mean, before that, I mean, a lot of you guys probably won't even remember. But, before September 11th, my dad, because we would travel back and forth between Illinois and California a lot, and my dad would literally be able to, like, walk us up to the gate right until we got onto the plane and sit with us. There was, like, no security. Or maybe there was, but, like, you could just go through it even if you didn't have a ticket. If you wanted to get through it. Which. And you guys, please let me know in the comments below because I'm sure I'm being so ignorant and stupid on this. Okay, I get, like, having a ticket to go through security, but, like, obviously the people who did 9-11 had a plane ticket because they got on a plane, right? So, I wonder why they changed that rule. Like, you have to have a plane ticket to go through security. Why did they just not have security? I'm trying to think. They must have had it. I just, it wasn't as, definitely as not as intricate if there was any. I want to say no. And the whole world changed after that. And you know what? Everyone was scared for a while. I was scared for about a good year because we flew a lot as kids. Because, like, again, my mom was in one state, my dad lived in the other. I did not want to fly. I wanted to drive to California. What's scary is about what's happening now. I don't want to like harp on it because I kind of like to entertain and keep people's minds out of it. But like it's affecting everyone so different that gets it. It's really scary. I do try and stay home as much as I can to like cook. I, I get groceries now. I really do try to stay home. 
a package delivery and then leave it on my door. world is so scary right now I mean, all that's good is green fried cheese I've seen some people in other cities and countries like Canada and stuff get this but I don't look as good and there is another place here in LA I cannot show my face. That has them, but that's also not where it's at, you know? My and gong. <laughs> They're pretty busy today. Things are definitely like people are still going out. everyone's wearing their mask here it's like mandatory and the people like debating it and like trying to like protest it like really trust me i'm scared of it i do not think i'm exempt from it It's a really scary time, especially because you can't see our family. Like, my dad, I can't see my dad. Like, I see my mom and my sister. Those are the two people I see. But even my dad, like, doesn't, you know, he's really taking it really seriously and isolating him. I really miss him. With the stay at home place, like, till August, it's just like, gosh, there's so much hair on my face. Mm. I gotta go home. Um, yeah. Well, anyways, thanks for eating lunch with me. <laughs> Dear Evan Hansen just makes me feel like this. Like, mm. Follow me on TikTok. There's a guy who comes up with really good Broadway songs but makes some TikTok dances. I don't know his name, but I tagged him in this one. Well, I forgot to tag him on the main thing. He did the sexy one from Mean Girls. Um, he did it waving through the window. Dear Evan Hansen. I'll look at some of the other ones he did. He did He did a few. He did some Hades Down ones. Um... There were some vloggers in there <laughs> vlogging their experience, which is cute. It's cute to see people like still trying to like be as normal as pop possible, I guess. But anyways. all right, guys, thanks for eating with me. I'm gonna go home and wash my hands and wash everything. But be safe, stay safe. I love you.